When 18 times a number is increased by 12, the result is the same number, plus 228. What is the number? So on this one, we can write an equation for this. So we have 18 times a number. We'll use x as the number. Now we're going to increase this by 12. And that result is the number plus 228. Now we like the principles of equality to solve this one. So we got to decide, though, which side we want the x's on. I'd just say let's put them on the left, because there's more of them on the left. So I'm going to subtract, and we would say that's a 1x. So I'll subtract a 1x here as well. That becomes a 0. And I still have this 228. And the plus 12. But 18 minus 1 would be a 17x. Now we have the x's on the left, but we also have that plus 12. It doesn't have an x, so it's an unlike term. We got to get rid of it and move it, essentially move it to the other side. So I can do that by subtracting 12. But if I do it to one side, I've got to do it to both. That becomes a 0. I still have my 17x's. This is equal to 228 minus 12. So 8 minus 2 is 6. 2 minus 1 is 1. And we got 216. All right, to solve this one, we'll divide both sides by 17. And we get x equals, uh, let's see this, we got 216 divided by 17. 17 will go into 21 once. So when we subtract, we get a 4, we'll drop the 6. 17 will go into 46 twice, two times. So 2 times 17 is 34. When we subtract this, we get 12. And we could say we got 12 17ths remaining. So the mixed number here is okay. 12 and, well, 12 seventeenths. So we had this 12 remaining there. 17 doesn't go into 12 evenly. Uh, and since we don't really care about decimals yet, we can just make that a uh, mixed number right there. And so 1 minus 18 would give us a negative 17x plus the 228 equals, now that's a positive 12 term. Now we have the 228 with that negative 17x, which is no good. We've got to get rid of it, subtracting 228 from both sides. And that also would give us a negative. Negative, uh, well, 216 equals negative 17x. Now when we divide both sides by negative 17, the negatives cancel out in both situations. The 17s will cancel out here into a 1. And we already did 216 divided by 17. That gave us the answer right here.